Hey guys, so today I am doing the 50 things you don't, yeah, you don't know about me or probably don't know. <laughs> if you know me well, then you'll know a bunch of these things. If you don't know me, then you don't know these things. Okay, so let me get started because this will take a little while. <laughs> Here we go. Number one, I know how to ride a skateboard. I actually used to ride a skateboard to high school. That was my mode of transportation and I loved it. Um, I lived in California, so it was easy. I can still ride a skateboard. Number two, I am obsessed with Myers-Briggs personality typing. If you've never heard of it, I will link it down below. It is awesome. I am an INFJ, which is a very rare personality type, and it just explains so much about my personality, things that I thought maybe were wrong with me, which actually are not wrong they're just who I am so yeah it was it's awesome I love Myers Briggs number three we're gonna get a little dark my nose is broken yes so when I was really young really young I was in a really bad relationship and during an argument my ex punched me in the face and broke my nose so yeah I hate that but hey what can I do I try to contour a little bit nowadays, try to help it because it's something that I do fixate on a bit because it's messed up my face forever. Okay, number four. Um, I love things with sad emotional undertones, like songs that have that sad, you know, type of melodic music and movies. Yes, I love it. For me, sadness is, sadness is genuine. People can fake happy, like they can be like, oh, I'm so happy, and they can fake that. But sadness is really hard to fake. Like you can tell when someone's not being real, you know, when they're not like really sad. Number five, <laughs> I eat something spicy almost just about every day. Yes, just like I drink coffee every day, I eat something spicy every day, <laughs> I think. I'm just addicted to spiciness. I love spicy food. <laughs> Number six, I am an artist. Not just a makeup artist, but an artist. I draw, I paint. Um, yeah. So, I'm gonna show you. Here's one of my drawings. It's not that new, but that's what I do. I've been doing it since I was a little kid, so yeah. It's, it's, my, uh, it's my thing. Yeah. Next, number seven. I absolutely love Amy Lee of Evanescence. I've loved her since I was like 21. And I saw that first video, Bring Me to Life, and I was done. I've watched hundreds of her interviews and stuff. And you know what? She is my doppelganger when it comes to like things we like and even the way we think. I swear it's like I hear myself in that screen and it freaks me out because I'm like how can she be so much like me freaks me out and yes I have been told that I look like her and mm, I see it sometimes when we make like certain facial expressions and her pictures kind of look like my face but like off the bat not really <laughs> but yes I love her forever until the day I die we were born the same year too which is awesome I do love to sing I sing all the time. Please sell something in the wind that feels like tragedies that end. And though I'd like to stand by you, can she? Usually to Evanescence, Deftones, um, I sing to recently Disturbed because I love hard rock metal music. My most favorite movie of all time since I was like five or six is The Labyrinth. I love The Labyrinth. That movie just was amazing to me and still is to this day with the music and David Bowie. 
God rest his soul. Number 10. I love Tim Burton and Tim Burton movies. I love his style. I love his vision. I love his stories. The music. I love it all. I love the darkness. I love how quirky and artistic it is. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love Love. love. 11. My favorite wine is Merlot. It could be Cupcake. It could be, you know, some other name brand. <laughs> But if it's Merlot, I love it. My favorite beer is a stout. My beer brew is a stout beer, dark and rich and heavy. And my favorite beer is Dragon's Milk. Number 12. I don't like manicures or pedicures. I don't like people touching my feet or my hands. Number 13. I actually enjoy doing labor work. And by that I mean, you know, carrying heavy stuff, doing yard work, things that like make you sweat and make you really like just work. I love that, but I hate, hate housework. I think it's so mundane, so endless and just boring. So yeah, I don't like cleaning. I do it, but I hate it. Number 14, I actually recently discovered that I can make voices thanks to the Snapchat face uh, filters that, you know, warp your face and make you look ridiculous. Yeah, I've made several characters and made voices for those characters and I have a blast with it. Number 15, my favorite coffee creamer is Almond Joy. I love Almond Joy. I used to love hazelnut and I drank hazelnut a lot. I hate hazelnut. <laughs> and I loved it a lot. But when I discovered Almond Joy, that was it for me. Number 16, my favorite colors are red, Forever, forever red, and not just any red. Like that red back there, meh. This red, rich red, I love. Black, of course, always. Gray, yes, I love gray. And teal, I love teal. Not turquoise, turquoise is light tone. Teal is dark. Number 17, I love owls. I think they're so beautiful and like mysterious and just, just gorgeous. Uh, my favorite owls are the barn owl and the snowy owl. I love the barn owl's heart-shaped face. Oh, I, I love them. I think they're just absolutely beautiful. Number 18, I grew up having dogs as pets. I mean, we had a lot of dogs and other animals, but I do prefer cats. And this is my baby. <laughs> we actually had an orange cat, but he passed away and we rescued this guy. I always wanted a black cat again, because I've had black cats before. Um, his name is Panther Jax, and he's a sweetheart. Number 19, when I was a teenager, I wanted a red star um, tattoo. I think I wanted it like here or somewhere, I don't know. I loved, I love red of course, but I love stars, and that's the tattoo I wanted. Though I did not ever get a tattoo, because I've always been very cautious. Until this year, I got this tattoo, custom made, of course, because I'm very picky of things. <laughs> Especially if it's permanent, it has to look good. <laughs> so I got this for my birthday this year. Number 20, when I was little, and I mean like maybe toddler little or kindergarten little, I don't remember, my great grandmother's dog bit my face. So I have a scar in this area of where the dog just chomped on me. I don't hate dogs though. <laughs> I still like dogs. I have a dog. So yeah, I love I love animals, period. Number 21. I've had YouTube for 9 years, but my first makeup tutorial was 5 years ago and I only, and I started doing tutorials consistently 3 years ago. So sort of long not really <laughs> number 22 i love widow's peaks i know i'm weird i love when people have that little widow's peaks my husband has one <laughs> i love it i don't know why i don't i just have this yeah i love when people have the little peak right there number 23 my skin is so translucent that you can see my veins. And I'm not just saying like here where everybody can see the veins. No, I mean like 
everywhere. You can't tell on camera because I don't know why. Everywhere you could see my veins. I don't really mind it, but it's kind of weird, I guess. Number 24, my favorite YouTubers are that Tayla. I love her. I love her personality, her style. Um, I love how she just, she is who she is. She's very honest and you can tell. Um, I love Tati because she's very sweet. Um, she's very classy and she's helpful too. I love Kathleen Lights because she kind of reminds me of one of my sisters. I don't know if it's her personality or the way she looks. And Mikey from Glam and Gore. She is awesome, super talented, super creative, and I just love her. Number 25. Five foods that I love are ceviche, butter chicken, sushi, steak, and Caesar salad. I love those five foods. Hey guys, please go watch part two. I couldn't put it all in one video, so I needed another video for this. I will link it down below in the caption box for you, so please, yeah, go watch it, go watch it now, right now, right now, click, click, click the link.